Hello everyone, it's Jay here again today, and today I'm going to be showing you, how, you guys how to install another mod, Tale of Kingdoms, uh, version 1.03. Um, it's a very good mod that has come out, I have yet to play it yet, but of course I saw it on the Minecraft forums because I'm always checking that. Um, it looks like a really awesome mod, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to install it. Um, keep in mind, this is my second time installing it, I installed it once, made sure it worked, and we're going to go ahead and do it again. So yeah, let's get started. To start, you're going to want to download the link in the description. It's going to be called Tales of Kingdoms underscore version 1.0.3 AIO. That stands for all in one. Um, that'll just help you get everything one simple download. Um, so yeah, just download that from the description. And then we'll start by opening this, opening this up. Now keep in mind, you will need WinRAR, or however you want to pronounce it, however you want to say it, uh, or 7-Zip to open it. Um, if, you do, if you did download WinRAR, you want to open with, and then WinRAR right there, see? So yeah, we'll just drag and drop these two onto our desktop. You highlight them, drag and drop. Just go ahead and close this. You can either save or delete the AIO. I'm gonna save it just in case something goes wrong. I doubt it will, but we'll do it anyways. Um, now to start, uh, it's really simple from here. We're gonna open up our Minecraft. This is just a simpler way of getting to our app data. Um, if you know uh, the percent app data trick, then you can go ahead and do that. But for now, we're just gonna stick with this. So if you have this launcher right here, you want to click options, and then you want to click the blue wording right here underneath the force update. You click that. Um, it'll take a second, but there there comes up a new window here. Um, we can just go ahead and close Minecraft for now. Uh, what we're gonna want, what we're gonna want to do now is we're gonna want to open up bin. Like so, and then we want to open up our Minecraft.jar. Now, keep in mind if this does not look like a little book, you right click it and then open with Renrar Archiever because it'll more than likely not look like that. So, make sure you do that. I'll go ahead and do that like you guys would. So, here we go. <coughs> so, now that we have this open, just click, yeah, just close that. And then, uh, first, what you want to do is you want to click meta inf and delete that. Like, delete, yes, of course, I want to delete it. Um, now what you're going to want to do is you want to open up my loader by double clicking it and there we go highlight everything in here drag and drop okay just go ahead and close my loader now you can probably delete this I'm going to delete it because I don't need it next we want to install the, ta the Tale of Kingdoms version 1.0.3 this is the most recent ver version as of today um, so yeah you guys should be happy for that drag and drop this into here press ok Go ahead and close this. You can delete this or save it. I'm just going to delete because I cut my AIO. And now we just go ahead and close our Minecraft.jar. And now we can just simply start our Minecraft. Um, you can close this too. It doesn't really matter anymore. Um, I'll go ahead and into the world and show you guys that it works. You'll know that the mod works um, because a menu will pop up and ask you if you want to start your quant, it's just quant quest. Your conquest. <laughs> um, but yeah, just go ahead and log in. Um, if for some reason, if this does not work, please don't complain. I'll be glad to help you. You can message me, and then I will set up an arrangement to help you out. And even if that does not work, I will help you via Skype. Um, I'm great with helping people out. Just make sure uh, they don't expect too much. <laughs> All right, but let's just start. Um, let me render down my world real fast off my options here. And turn that off. No. All right, done, done. Single player, create new world. Uh, you can name it anything you want. I'm just gonna leave it new world. Let that open up. Um, it's gonna build the terrain. I'm gonna pause it and let it generate. And here we go. Upon entering the world, in about two seconds, uh, this thing popped up here. Um, there you go. It says 1.0. But it's at, it is 1.0, but it's actually 1.0.3. They just don't put that in there. Um, but yeah, then you just click Start Your Conquest, and it'll probably lag maybe a split second. For me, it's going to lag because I am uh, recording, of course. And then the second you go ahead and click that, uh, you will be able to see a gravel stone wall right, or not wall, a uh, little pathway right here. And that's how you know. Uh, I would suggest using Doku's Doku Craft uh, texture pack. It's a really good texture pack. Um, probably not a good idea to put it here, but uh, yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, please stick around. Please subscribe and uh, give me a like. Leave a good comment. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, see you around.